What's up guys, this is Wally coming at you again from the Beaver Valley Mall. I'm at the site of the abandoned Macy's, which went out of business, I think last year, if I'm not mistaken. Still really clean here, obviously it's part of the mall, so they take care of the property here. Uh, but we'll do a walk around and check it out. So as you can see, this is a pretty large store. It's in pretty good shape. I don't know when it closed. I think last year, but I could be wrong. I know the gear shots will know. Check out his channel too, guys. He does a lot of videos in this area. I just happen to be up here for the day, so I thought I'd do a couple while I'm out. I don't know if this was a one floor store or two floor store, I'm not sure. So I parked way in the back to get the uh, photo for the thumbnail. I couldn't even get the whole building in it. It was so large. And no, I still haven't stopped for flip-flops. I got to do that. Was going to take a look in the doors here, but they're uh, papered up pretty good. There's another entrance to my left, so I'll go check that out too. I don't know if we'll be able to see anything in here or not. Probably not. Nah, just the other doorway. Wish it would focus. Sorry about that, guys. Oh well. No. It's musty here, too, so obviously it's been gone for a while. The door is locked. Take a walk to the other doorway here. pavement looks brand new like the sidewalk here looks like they just did it not too long ago it's in excellent shape I don't know what their plan is for this store Beaver Valley Mall took a big blow here losing this store this was their like biggest anchor besides uh, JC Penney Boscovs so I don't know From what I understand though, this whole mall is suffering, so I'm not really shocked that this closed up here. We are quite a bit away from downtown Pittsburgh. We're in Beaver County. Yep, store closed. Yep, we know. Door is locked, I can already see it. Yep, all you see is another doorway and some lights. More paper. Wonder why they do that. I guess to uh, make it not look like an eyesore or to deter anybody from getting inside like me. <laughs> or to do worse. Oh, you almost came to a complete stop. Just speed through the parking lot there. Good job. Here's a look at the side of the building here. I guess, uh, I don't know which you would consider the back side. I guess this would be. You can see my car, it's parked way over there, so I got a heck of a walk. We'll go check it out though. Check out the other doors here. I hate that that keeps doing that. I seriously need new flip-flops. I keep complaining, but then I don't get them. I'll get them after this video. I mean, hey, I'm at the mall. Check it out. Nope. I'm not going to be getting in this store. I can tell you that now. I don't even know. No way. <laughs> I like it though. It still looks nice for uh, being abandoned, which is good. Not quite sure what this was here that they have uh, the wall redone. I don't know what's up with that. I can see lights on inside of this entrance.
the mall of Robinson. Wonder how long it'll be until that one's gone. I mean, the mall at Robinson's a pretty busy mall. No luck. I don't know what you could see. I had to hold this up pretty high. Is this a doorway? There are lights on inside though. I think. <laughs> Guessing this was uh, Macy's receiving area. That's yeah, pretty uh, cluttered. I don't know if this is all still Macy's or not. That probably isn't because that door's open. I don't know if this is or not. I doubt it from the looks of it. No. Maybe at one point in time it was, but it's not anymore. I'm not even gonna try that door. I hear the alarm going off. <laughs> okay, so I'm inside the Beaver Valley Mall now, and I was making my way to the interior entrance of Macy's for you guys. And just walking through a quarter of this mall, I can tell you this place is hurting. Hurting bad. It looks nice, but there are a lot of empty stores in here. So I might just have to do a video on this dying mall for you guys. Anyway, here's the entrance to Macy's from the inside. If you read that sign, it says the fountain is temporarily out of service. Yeah, you're telling me. This was the old Macy's entrance from the inside of the mall. Got it boarded up good, so I'm not going to be able to see inside of it. Alright, so I'm back outside. Getting a view of the other Macy's entrance. I guess the main entrance to the store. The uh, sign, or what's left of it, is hidden behind the trees. Walk up to the door, check it out. Nice entrance, dirty windows. Check it out. Door closed. Sadly, there are a lot of closed stores in this mall. Nope. Last door to check. Locked. Well, I tried. Kind of figured I wouldn't get in. There's the last uh, corner of the store. I'm not even going to waste my time checking those doors. Watch, those will be the ones that open. It's the old Macy sign hidden by the trees. Look at the star. And then my car is back there in that parking lot. All right, well, there you go, guys. That was my look at the abandoned Macy's here at Beaver Valley Mall. Uh, if you haven't noticed, too, I'm rocking my new Hills shirt that I got. I love this shirt. Awesome. Anyway, if you enjoyed this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up and you subscribe to my channel for more content. And until next time, guys, take care. Talk to you later.